and to the saints of the Most High God. You're now listening to the Whole Truth Program, coming to you from the sanctuary of the church in the Lord Jesus Christ of the Apostle of Faith Incorporated with Bishop Joe C. Tisday as pastor and general overseer. Now let's bow our heads in prayer and meditations as we're led by Deacon Swinney. Most holy and kind Heavenly Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we want to pray and thank you for all your love and your kindness and your tender mercy and many blessings which you extend the walls in the last new days. We well, thank the Lord how you watch over through the night, waking up this morning, closing in my right mind. Give me that to my limb, my God, and give me a mind to call upon your holy and righteous name today. Pray, my God, Lord, bless my God this broadcast is not going forth to the way of the air. Pray, my God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, may help some poor soul to see the light. That blinded eye be opened to death, yet be unstopped in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Best bits of Tuesday, my God, we bring us words, my God, for comfort to our soul. Courage us, my God, how to lean out on you and trust my God. Someone's heart, heart may be open, my God. Blinded eye may be open. My God, the death yet be unstuck, my God. Turn on thee and be saved before the everlasting time too late. Give me mind to repent of their sin, my God, to be baptized in water. In your precious name, tear into their soul, be filled with the Holy Ghost, speak with tongue and the Spirit of God, give unto Remember those that are bound by the power of the enemy, my God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Give them strong, resistant power, resist the, resist the power of the devil in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Bless the saints of God everywhere, my God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Bless them one by one with the blessing and outstanding them. Help us, my God, to be real and sincere, working our soul salvation with fear and with trembling. My God, remember the sick and afflicted one. My God, as you will, touch and heal their body, my God. Help them realize you're the heal alone by yourself. Problem solved, may, may wake all we need is in you, my God. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, you grant our petition, we give you the praise. We give you the thank forever. All the blessings we ask in the name of Jesus Christ, the glory of God. Amen. Amen. Again, you're listening to the Whole Truth Program. If you have any questions or comments, you may mail your correspondence to The Church in the Lord Jesus Christ of the Apostle of Faith Incorporated, Bishop Joe C. Tisdale, Post Office Box 2017, Hartsville, South Carolina, 29551. You can also call our toll-free number at one 877 Three three two five six six one. You may visit our website for additional church information, information such as beliefs and calendar events, as well as audio sermons preached by Bishop Tisdale. Our official website address is www.thechurchin.org. Now, at this time, the choir render a selection entitled "Glory to His Name." Tisdale. We do give honor to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, Christ, 
we greet every one of you, all of our listeners, all of our supporters. We greet you very much with love, joy, and peace. May it be multiplied unto you in the name of Jesus Christ. We are very thankful that the Lord has allowed us another day, another day to receive his great plan of salvation. Jesus says of a sure that I am the way, the truth, and the light. No man cometh unto the Father, the Spirit, but by me. He is the only wise God, our Savior. And the Bible tells me that we all should have the same mind, and we should all have the same rule. Now, we all intend to be raptured together with God. We all will have to be the same here upon this earth. Amen. There's no such thing that we're going to live anyway, anyhow, and go with God when he comes. Amen. Everybody has to be like Jesus Christ was when he was here. He did those things he said to please the Father, the Spirit. Whatever he did, it was according to the Father's will. And he did those things to show us that we have eternal plan of salvation with him. And we all should want to be with God today. Everybody should want to be with God. Now, I know it's a way to man, but God have his way. Amen. 14 chapter of Proverbs, 12 verse. Amen. God have a way for the human family. God's way is that everybody be like him. Amen. All you people in radio land, television land. God is trying to warn you, even on the YouTube, trying to warn you, amen, throughout the whole entire world. Amen. You have to remember what the Lord say now. Amen. It's a wide gate here. Mm -hmm. It's a broad way. Right. Bible say, which leads to destruction. And many are going to find this way. Many people, I know you don't like to hear these things, but it's the word of God. Many people not going to make it in. I may as well tell you the truth like the word of God. Word of God is true. It is pure. It's everything we need pertaining to salvation. And the word says, what? Proverbs 14 and 12. Yeah. There is a way which seemeth right unto a man. Now I know it's a way. You listen here. Amen. This is the truth. I speak the truth in Christ and I lie not. Amen. There is a way that seemeth right to a man. But the end thereof are the ways of death. Now the end of it. Are the ways of death. You hear the word here. Amen. If I try coming to God my way, mm -hmm. my doings, and it seem right, but when it come to the end, you have to remember Jesus Christ says in the first book of Revelation, the word says, Behold, he cometh with clouds. Every eye going to see him. They also which pierced him in his side. All kindreds of the earth going to wail because of him. And what the Lord say here. Amen. Amen. Revelation 1 and 7. Yeah. 